Ramaphosa apologized to the local judge, John Thorpe. Did I say that? Oh, yeah. If you like, you can say former judge, Mr. Thorpe. Well, things were happening in parliament today. And Ramaphosa was told, Baba, you need to apologize. You really need to apologize. And that was started by Umzan Alemanyi. Called Ramaphosa into order and said, listen, Baba. You shouldn't be saying what you are saying. You are disrespectful. You are a president of this country. Behave like a president. You cannot disrespect John Lope like that, Dr. John Lope. And then he did it as business as usual. Hoy, I know you think I'm just making up the story. No, it's not basically a, a fiction. This is not a fiction, right? This is a real story which happens today there by parliament when Mzanele Mani called Ramaphosa into order and said this. Honorable Mani, you raised your hand. I will now recognize you. Yeah. Uh, thank you, Deputy Speaker. Uh, Deputy Speaker, you know, towards the end of last year, there was a spirited attempt, uh, or rather a, a spirited effort, to knock to shape the rules of this house and in order to improve decorum and all of that, so that we don't have a situation where when the president is addressing, then there's a whole flurry of point of orders and all of that. Now, if you have a situation where, despite those rules to try and maintain order in this house, you then have a, a president that was part of an impeachment process that now continues to mock our party leader here in parliament. Honorable Mani, that, that is... We have a problem. The president that cannot is a continue. question of debate. It is not a point of order. The, the, the president cannot continue to keep mocking our party leader as a judge when he knows that they participated in a process to unfairly impeach him. Now he impeaches him on the one side and he mocks him again. Honorable Mani. cannot be allowed. All right. Having said that, uh, after that, I'm going to play you the video now. Garamaposa apologizing to Judge John Thlop. Former judge, woman, Dr. John Thlop. Hey, it appears like a, a MK party, uh, they've just arrived, but wow. Their impact is... <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I, I'm even... You know, I can't even put it into words. You know what? You know why I'm saying this? Because those moments, they count in terms of promoting your political party and promoting yourself and having an impact. But again... Looking at the man himself, Um Donelemani, the fact that he shifted from e EFF and then he goes into he goes into he shifted from EFF and then he goes into uh, MK Party. And when he gets to MK Party, uh, if you're looking at his participation, it appears like he was given uh, a minimal role at local within the EFF. But when he shift now, it gets to MK Party. It looks like now he's got a bigger role because he's now uh, one of their key players as opposed to in the EFF. You will hardly hear Mzone uh standing up and addressing them. You know what I'm saying? You'll hardly hear that. But now, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So one might say that it was helpful for him to shift uh, from one political party to another while others say calling him a, a Zuma loyalist because, uh, well, we all know. Uh, names, after names 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 after names, right? <laughs> that is what they do the best. They give you names after names. But nonetheless, um, we're not going to talk about Jacob Zuma. At least not now, right? We're not, at least not now. What we're going to be talking about, it is this. If you are not yet subscribed, what are you waiting for? Come on, good people. Because to subscribe, it is free. To like the video, it is free. To comment in the comment section below, it is free of charge. To click the notification bell, it is free of charge. To share this video, it is free of charge. To watch this video until the end, it is free of charge. Also, good people, I mean, come on, to watch the ads, it's free of charge, and that's how you financially contribute to this YouTube channel. Speaking about financial contribution to the channel, you can join, become a member of this YouTube channel from as likely as 20 rand a month. You can also uh, use the Super Thanks Party. In case you don't want to do that, guys, there is a way where you can use my media company banking details. 
to donate to the channel and you know what i'm saying we'll bring you more and also guys want to buy more equipment so the power is in your hands please do the honorable thing as we proceed let's go before we talk about uh before we talk about uh, 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 before i show you the video karam ram when he apologized to judge former judge uh from a former western cape what present yeah is it called what yeah uh, not that word but he was in charge of the western cape you know what i'm saying um the reason when it comes to one will ask uh, look one will one will have to ask themselves why is the mk party quick to remind him even the eff they were very quick to remind him when he called Uchach Shlope, Uchach Shlope, they were like, not you. So one will have to ask themselves, why is the EFF and the MK party very uh, critical when it comes to Ramaphosa? They ask, he is not allowed, everybody else can be allowed, but he's not allowed to, he's not allowed to, uh, to, to call Judge Shlope, to even mistakenly call Judge Shlope. You know why? Because the man himself was involved in the removal of Judge Shlope. So he knows exactly the place that they orchestrated in getting get re, getting rid of Judge Lobe. Therefore, he must always bear in mind that he will always refer to him as Doctor Lob. Definitely not as Judge Lob. Take a look at him apologizing here. I'd like to say to Honorable Manning and uh, indeed to Honorable Shope that if my reference to the title is offensive. I apologize and I withdraw. So uh, uh, it's not a matter that um, one should articulate if uh, it is found to be offensive. And, it, and I guess maybe uh, because of having been legally trained, when you see another person who has been legally trained, uh, you have that tendency of of uh, wanting to okay 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 so now you have had the man apologizing like i was saying previously that the reason i think they are very critical when it comes to him it is simply because he orchestrated the downfall of ucho um Lop. and i i even remember when Lop stood up uh, he rebuked Ramaphosa and said to Ramaphosa, "Don't call me, don't call me Judge Lope. You know what happened. Do you remember him saying that? You know what happened. So please, do not call me Judge Lope. Do not. So it appears like there's that bit of, I wouldn't say bitterness, but I would say there's that thing of, hey, my brother, hey, 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 Mr. President." I don't know why. You know, these days, guys, I will be recording and feeling a bit tired. But I think I need a massage. You know, now right now I'm feeling the same thing. But I think I need a bit of a massage because wow, it's been um, it's been days. You know what I'm saying? But that that's not where we are. I'm just I was just saying, good to give. According to you, I need you to get into the comment section below. I need you to tell me what you think about. Uh, why these people? Why do you feel these people are very uh, hostile towards Ramaphosa whenever he refers to Judge Lope as Judge Lope? Because uh, for me, it's just because I mean they are saying, "Man, you were involved. You orchestrated this, so you should know it better than everybody else here. So don't pretend like you don't know anything here. Duh, don't pretend like you don't know anything here. You know everything here." You know anything here. And so since you do, therefore, please do me a favor, right? Refer to me as Dr. Shlop and not Judge Shlop. And the man apologized. What's the take? Let's talk about the apology of the man himself, uh, Ramaphosa. He apologized. Tell me what you think about all of these things. What What's your take about it? Get into the comment section below. Tell me what you think about it. All of this.